Where are all of you doing? You are cordially invited to return to the coins alert your house for your Bitcoin fix. Ripple Van Winkle is your host for this event. I really hope that everyone is having a wonderful day. This is Monday, and we are almost at the end of the week. It is amazing to watch it. My dear Knicks, if they had been able to maintain their health from the previous night, I am telling you that they would have made it to the finals of that team. As many as four persons were lost. Due to a fractured hand, Brunson was forced to leave the decisive game. We are hoping to make some. Significant moves throughout this offseason. In spite of this, the Rangers are still in the playoffs, and their first game of the NHL season is scheduled for Wednesday. For that reason, I am looking forward to this episode. There are frauds going on out there, and we are going to warn you about them because I want you to be protected. What makes XRP such a valuable asset? Let's hear from CryptoTired. You're going to want to pay attention to what they have to say. The next topic on the agenda is going to be InBridge. What exactly is the InBridge Ripple project? Will they be involved with XRP? I have you covered with the top three coins to watch this week across the board. We are going to bring everything out as well. And then we are going to bring in bricks and digital assets with the finish line people. We are going to squeeze everything in. So take a seat, relax, and let's get started. There are 67,171 Bitcoins for sale. It is currently down 2% over the course of the previous 24 hours. The value of Ethereum is $3,102 billion. At the moment, it is 3% lower than it was before. Yes, you can. To get the general idea from this, it is quite unlikely that you will enjoy it. In addition to USDT and USDC, XRP is also coming in at their respective dollar pegs. Even if it is down 1.18%, it is still a mean lead of 51 cents. Exactly 178,012 pennies is a significant amount of money. To be honest, it's not that bad. A little bit later on in this episode, we are going to spend some time discussing that. Please remember Star Wars. Between every two Lux Lions, according to the fact that we are now doing tests, I don't see why I shouldn't declare that every two we have three t-shirts remaining. Digital goods that are physical, you purchase two NFTs. You receive a t-shirt and you purchase four NFTs. There is a hoodie melt that is delivered to your home directly. The design of Lux Lines that is a gift from the Lux Lion squad, but there are only three of each remaining, and that is the end of it. However, if you do not have your NFT time to pick it up, James Rule put this out there. We are simply currently in the testing phases before the shop goes up and running. It is possible that you will come across this floating around over there, and if you do come across it floating around, you will find it on YouTube. Avoid coming into contact with it. This is not real. Okay, artificial intelligence has reached such a level of excellence. Despite the fact that it is terrifying, this will attract a large number of newcomers will be providing you with XRP. It is quite unlikely that anyone will ever request that you link your wallet. You will never hear anyone tell you that you should award them an additional thousand points. In addition to that, they are going to give you a thousand dollars back. It is imperative that you do not fall for this con, people. We are getting quite close to the end of the race. The last thing I want is for someone to be restrained. Individuals are extremely terrible out there. They have no feelings. If you get harmed in a scam like this, such individuals are out there. They have no feelings and they will never hesitate to grab your XRP without giving it a second thought under any circumstances. The Bitcoin coverage strangle approach is preferred by the research firm in order to increase the yield on his portfolio by 17%. A company that conducts research, it has been suggested by 10x that Bitcoin holders can increase the yield on their portfolio by 17% by utilizing the option technique. The research conducted by 10x proposes selling call and put options that are related to Bitcoin that are out of money while also holding the cryptocurrency in the spot market. A yield of 17% is expected to be generated via the so-called coverage triangle approach. Watch out for that. Obviously, this is something that piques your interest and makes you happy. Could it be something that you would be interested in participating in for me? That is a really quick response. I'm going to just sit here and wait, and when the time comes, I'll sell my cryptocurrency. My dear Erie, this is a very pleasant interview. This is exactly what she did. XRP, why is it still relevant today? In light of the fact that there are money movers that splay 20% in cross-border transfer fees in African corridors, I will give her a small like an RT on this. She was on right here with Jake Lee, who was from a percent. Have a listen. You know, I live in Tokyo, and so I experienced that pain point of cross-border remittances firsthand and, and the, the ability to actually transfer funds and value using the digital asset XRP within literally two, two to three to five seconds max for just fractions of a penny is quite important. And so with that pain point, I think, I think it's still relevant, especially for all the migrant workers that are around the world that sacrifice left their countries or working in places that they have to send money home to every month. This is still a really 
relevant pain point, and there are certain parts of the world where the transmitters are still charging them in insane amounts of money like 7%. It can even reach as high as 20% in certain regions of Africa. Therefore, this is basically because, as you probably already know, it is all about also offering an equitable solution, and XRP is still delivering that equitable solution, which is something that is really important. Spot on. She is spot on. And I was just on a live broadcast the other day. If you didn't catch it, you should go catch it with Jay. However, if you are interested in knowing who I am, my camera was on. Looking neat and tidy, you are aware of this? When we try to send money to, for example, people outside of the United States, they don't really comprehend what we're talking about. When they use a service such as Western Union or MoneyGram, they say things like, hey, you know, it's going to cost $25 to $25. Basically, we just take a look at it. It doesn't matter to us, but that $25 to $25 could be enough to pay someone in Thailand or Singapore for a whole day's labor. However, you should know that they do not make the same amount of money that we do here. Therefore, the reduction of that price does make a difference nevertheless. I don't believe that you truly. Understand the current scenario of how money goes across international borders until it has an impact on you. Let me get this straight in order for a team to be a championship contender. All of the parts of the puzzle need to be in the right location. The Ripple team dominates the competition. You can see who is present here. The venerable James Wallace is shown here. I'll blow it up for you. While he was serving as Apple's vice president, the company introduced a new BIs. This is an update on the Inbridge project. Listen, I'm not going to play all of this. Having said that, let's return to the project that Inbridge is. In order to achieve instant cross-border payments, it is a shared payment infrastructure that makes use of CBDC, specifically wholesale CBDC, from the central banks that are participating. Having just listened to the panel, a lot of the concepts that they discussed are wholesale, but a CBDC-1 platform that is interoperable by design, and the settlement finality is two-tier atomic settlement. That is the goal that we have set for ourselves with the Enbridge plan. It is correct that the fundamental system does not make use of XRP, rather we are utilizing the same technology that it is with the XRP ledger, which would be the CBDC. That's okay. To put it another way, the central bank would actually produce their very own token, which would be a digital euro or digital dollar, depending on the mark the market is at. This token would then become a digital asset and serve as the native coin. The coin of the lands there is a possibility that XRP may come into play in a situation where you are looking at a cross-border transaction. If you want to engage with people from other countries, you definitely need to have some kind of digital digital pound. My opinion is that the BIA school is a multi-CBDC model. In order to transition from one currency to another, one of the concepts is to utilize a neutral bridging currency, which is analogous to the model that I described previously, particularly in situations when there is no on-demand liquidity. XR is not the fundamental product, but you should know that it is the core offering. There is no XRP connected to this. CBDC is the abbreviation for the native token. The Inbridge was constructed on three primary pillars, and we have always believed that it is essential to not merely think about these things. On such a project as Inbridge, there is a great deal of activity. It is a digital money that is issued by many main banks. Platform payments for international transactions with you in mind. They are either seated on the board or at this table, and we are aware that there are ripples involved in this. There is a purpose for the lengthy table, and the top three coins to watch this week are all coins. This is Solana. Phantom and Link are both appealing to me. I really much enjoy it. Hey Solana, you should know that it's getting higher. We arrived around 130 and everything was wonderful for us. As of right now, the most important item to pay attention to regarding Chainlink is whether or not we have already touched